Oh, hello there. My brother didn't tell me that you were going to be spending the night over here tonight. It's no problem. It is just me and him here, after all. You're more than welcome to crash here on our couch whenever you like, dear. Our home is your home. Hmm? My brother just hopped in the shower, yeah? I heard that you two were out and about for most of the day. Did you have a good day together? Hmm, good. You two are almost inseparable now. I swear. It seems like I almost never see the two of you apart anymore. It's good that you two have such a strong connection. I'm very happy that he's got a good friend like you to keep his head on his shoulders. You know how he can be sometimes. If you don't keep his head out of the clouds, it's like he thinks he's the main character of a movie or something. I'm always worried that he's going to get into trouble. But... I feel a little better knowing that he's got a friend like you to keep him on the right path. You're always such a good influence on him. You're smart, motivated, and you always seem to know just what to say to defuse a tense situation. I presume that comes from years of having to stand up for yourself or your friends, yeah? Huh. It's funny how keeping a small social circle and having to grow up standing up for yourself changes a person, huh? Most people don't really know who they are until they're old enough to have a midlife crisis. But you're always so sure of yourself, and unwilling to change anything to make other people comfortable. I really admire that quality in a person. I always worried about my brother because he always wants attention, no matter who gives it to him. That kind of behavior usually leads to giving in to peer pressure or changing who you are to make other people happy. I can tell that since the two of you have gotten close, that he's really started to figure out who he is as a person. And I am extremely grateful for that. I mean, since the two of you have started hanging out more often, he's even gotten himself a job and a few hobbies. The fact that the two of you were both interested in the same series really made him more confident in owning what his passions are. I think it's wonderful that you empower him and everyone around you to fearlessly enjoy whatever brings them happiness. That's something that not a lot of people empower other people to do in this day and age. Everyone always seems so quick to judge or make fun of people for enjoying hobbies or interests that they don't think are cool enough to partake in. But, I think that if you find something that makes you happy, you shouldn't be afraid to enjoy it, right? I don't think it's right to make fun of someone for the movies or shows that they like to watch, the music they like to listen to, the games they like to play. I mean, why bother raining on someone else's parade when it doesn't even affect you? You know what I mean? <laughs> Who am I kidding? Of course you do. You're the entire reason that my brother feels so confident in what he's doing now. He's incredibly lucky to have a friend as wonderful and as thoughtful as you. I hope that the two of you stay friends for a very long time. So that I can see you around here more often. Mm-hmm. <laughs>